Hello everyone. Till now you have learned four lessons of science. First is eating habits of animals. Second is what are things made of. Third is rocks and soil. And the fourth one is our houses. Now you are going to learn something interesting which you always like to do. Yes, these are what? Domestic animals. In the first picture, horse is there, hen is there, then rabbit, then pig, then cow and etc. These are what? Domestic animals. You already know the meaning of domestic animals. Now, in this picture, what is shown? Yes, these are what? Wild animals. Tiger, zebra, elephant, lion, giraffe and etc. These are wild animals. You, you also know about wild animals. Yes, I am going to tell you about science project. In the science project, you have to draw or stick pictures of any two domestic animals and any two wild animals and write about their eating habits. What do they eat? How do they eat? What type of teeth they have? And you, all, you also have to mention whether they are herbivores, carnivores or omnivores. And on a separate sheet or a separate paper, you have to write about the process of achieving the curd. Yes, we have already discussed these things in lesson number 1. Again, I am repeating what you have to do. You have to draw or stick pictures of any two domestic animals and any two wild animals and write about their eating habits. What do they eat and how do they eat? Which type of teeth they have? And on a separate paper, write about the process of achieving the curd. For drawing and sticking pictures, you will use the papers from the previous class book. You can use paper from the old book. And you will use the material which is available at home. You are not going to buy anything from outside. For decoration, you can use beads, then you can use toothpick, anything. Which material is available at home? Now, the question comes in your mind that when to submit the project? You will submit the project once the school reopens. I hope you understood the project. Enjoy your holidays and stay home and stay safe. Thank you.